Like what's going on with me? It infuriates me. It genuinely makes my mind twist and it makes my mind just, it makes me mad. Bro, do not assume shit about people. Period. Especially people's mental health problems because you have no fucking idea. Even if you're going through similar problems to me, it's a completely different story because of 10 different variables that made up that situation. Okay? Dude, it is so fucked up that people constantly trying to evaluate my brain, evaluate what goes on with me when they don't even know a tenth of the fucking story because I've never let anyone know to protect these people. So it bothers me to my fucking core that there's still people out there that try to assume shit about me every day. Okay, let me just try to break down this whole beautiful story about my fucking life that everyone thinks, oh my god, you're so grateful, you're so blessed because you guys see an end part that I have to fucking struggle and work my fucking ass off working for five years every fucking day straight to achieve this. If I had a blessed life or a balanced life, I would never even be here. Like, you guys don't get it and it infuriates. It makes me so mad. Bro, like, people just assume that I have everything. I have everything? Are you stupid? Are you stupid? I All I have is some material. I don't even have all the material. I'm not a billionaire. I'm not even a hundred million. I'm not even a ten millionaire. Yeah, people act like I'm rich rich. Are you stupid? Bro, having a McLaren, having a watch. I don't even have a watch. Having a fucking house. Having It doesn't make you rich. What do you guys think rich is? You think because I'm not eating off the floor I'm rich? Are you crazy? So one, for people to think that I'm a billionaire, I can just buy a jet tomorrow and buy a jet for the next day is absolutely retarded. It's so stupid that people just assume I have wealth like that. And people don't even understand where my wealth goes. You think I have wealth to even focus on myself? Why do you think I don't buy shit for myself? Because I've been taking care of a family, three people, three adults for six years. Six years, I don't know any person in this fucking scene that takes care of their family like that. I'm the only person that I know of, and I take care of my family. That's where I put my money first. So obviously I've been adding this off time, and I've been going through shit. You don't have to worry about, oh, I'm gonna spend my money on this, this, this. No, I told my mom she would retire six years ago. I have to make sure my money's aside for her. I don't even see myself having anything. Because it's all for my family. So the fact that people think that I'm fucking rich and I'm just sitting, like, it's so annoying. Take that fucking shit out of your head. It's so annoying. And bro, what people don't understand, like, what, you're going on Twitter for attention? I'm going on Twitter for attention? You think if I wanted attention, I could do a million other things that seem more drastic. More I just go fucking crazy. I have not a single soul to talk to, so I tweet. I don't have anything. I don't have anyone to talk to. I don't have friends. I don't have my family I can talk to. I don't have fucking anyone. I don't have anyone, so I fucking go on Twitter sometimes, but I'm absolutely at the peak of my craziness. So yeah, I'll tweet some shit sometimes, but that's it. It's so infuriating that people think I'm doing this shit for attention, or I'm doing this shit for whatever. I'm not. Bro, I'm literally just going crazy every day because of the life that I live, the shit that got me here. People don't get that. Like, it's so annoying. You guys don't know how much people have fucked me over. You really don't know. Like, seriously. From my family to my friends to the people that I was supposed to, I was supposed to trust. Like, they all let me down. They all fucked me over. They all used me for shit. Bro, you guys don't know. I come from a world where I'm so nice and giving and wanting to give everyone the world. And I didn't realize that people are so bad. Ask any person I've ever given anything to. I don't take shit from people. When people offer shit, I don't take. I'm a giver. I don't take. I don't take shit from anyone. When people owe me thousands. And tens of thousands of dollars, I say no, keep it, I don't want it. I'm not like these fucking white people that fucking tax people, put people on contracts for the smallest little thing. Fuck them, my mental to give people thousands and thousands and thousands for years, and then the one time that they spot me like ten dollars, you'll PayPal me for that. What? Bro, you actually don't know how many people have been like that in my life, that I've given them thousands, and then they spot me one time because of a situation, and they want me to pay them for that. Like, I don't care about paying, obviously, $10, I don't give a fuck, but it's the principle. That's what people don't get. You guys are so technical. I'm a principle-based person. I do shit for reason. I'm different than you guys. You assume that I'm supposed to be happy. Because I, because yeah, you know, I have a place to live, I have a place to sleep, these people don't. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. I'm not gonna sit here comparing to myself to people that are lower or high. I don't care. This is my life. I'm not comparing myself to other people. I don't care. Like, fuck. And the reason you guys are also fucked up is because you compare yourself to people all the fucking time. Like, people don't understand. I, when I grew up, I had no one. Especially no one. My mom did not support me. My sister did not support me. My dad left my ass. Had no friends. So what the fuck? I played video games all day. Made a life for myself. And then everyone switches up on me and treats me like, oh, he actually is shit because he has money now. That's all you fucking shitty humans care about. Money. And yet you think that I care about it. It drives me crazy. It drives me crazy. Because I'm constantly being assumed that I did shit to get to there. And it's like, bro, 
I took, I'm negative $300,000 from FaZe. I have never ever gotten a dollar from this entire company. I've only gotten money for my FaZe Rain Man and those brand deals that I've done. FaZe has given me zero. Like, what are you talking about? G Fuel has ripped me off millions of dollars and only given me pennies to what I'm actually supposed to have made. CS Go Wild, and it's another thing that I'm supposed to make millions off of. I made 100K out of that, bro. 100K, that was a brand deal for me back then. For the 10 videos that I made promoting the thing, that's dick. How do you not get that dick for all the fucking stress I put myself through? For all the fucking bullshit that people blame me of owning and doing this and scamming people and all that. 100k? And I ended up losing like a million dollars between my cars alone. You think that was worth it for me to do all that for a hundred? I wish I made 10 million dollars, 20 million dollars off that. It would have been worth it. These people have caught up and assuming I'm this, I'm that, when I have nothing to do with it. You guys don't actually understand that I have nothing to do with this shit. Yet I'm the one that always gets blamed because I'm a scapegoat. And then even people in my house, they do that same shit to me. They use me as a scapegoat. They use all oh, this person's depressed. He's doing this. All this is use him as an excuse. It makes me crazy, especially the people that you've done so much for, that you've given everything to, and you've always been the person to never take anything back. That you've been like, no, you keep it, you do this or that. Yet I'm the person that still gets abused by everyone. And it drives me crazy. All these people trying to use my situation or try to make yourself sound like, oh, he has everything, this guy's tweaking, he's sad. Fuck you. And if you would want to say that shit, I beg you, come say that shit to my face. I fucking beg you. I beg, bro, you guys don't understand how crazy you guys have made me. Social media has made me crazy because you guys are trying to evaluate my life from fucking Twitter, bro. From fucking, like, you guys don't know me. My mom doesn't know me. So I how she talks to me. She talks to me like a kid from Twitter. I'm like, mom, you're supposed to be my mother. Why are you assuming? Dude, I'm just saying no one has my back. No one. Everyone just assumes and has... Man, it's so frustrating. You guys just don't get it. I swear to God, you guys don't get it. Seriously, I can't just sit there talking about everyone and how they've done me wrong. I'm not gonna ruin everyone else's fucking careers because if I told you, I'd say, yeah, I would ruin it, people. I don't want to, I don't care. I just don't want to be treated this way. Like if I treated people good, and I came from a world of not having shit and just giving everyone their back. Why do you gotta do that shit to me, man? I swear to God, you people don't get it. And it's so fucked. And I genuinely, look, I, I used to always wish that no one would go through what I went through. But I wish you all go through it. I wish every person talking shit goes through it. So you just know. I've been like this every day for years. And I'm making it up. It's crazy. It's crazy to me.